Hello, we're back. Here is another men's A tank and it's going to be a scrunch and it's going to be black. And <sighs> not really super special. Previously on another episode, <laughs> I had done a spider style uh, shirt in actual purple that I specifically bought for that and yellow for one of our gamer friends. It was going to be his birthday and a mutual friend of ours was paying for it and yeah. This shirt is actually for his wife and she knew about it but she didn't know about it but she we had asked her you know what kind of shirt she would be interested in and she says well do you have any tank tops and I'm like well no but I can get some and she goes okay just black in, in, in that like scrunchy style. I was like, okay. Feels really boring though. She might get something else. I don't know yet. This will have this video will probably be out before I send their stuff out because I have other videos that need to come out first. But it's what she wanted, and she wanted the men's style. I asked her if she wanted women's style tank top or if she wanted the men's, you know, wife beater as it's you know, slang term is, <laughs> I guess it's a slang term, um, oh, I'm from the country folks, okay, and I am a country girl, I am not a redneck, like my husband is most times, I am country, but, yeah, she just wanted a plain black and white in a men's A tank, so, Okay, that's what she wants. That's what I'm gonna get her. But she might get something else in addition. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. But in the meantime, our gamer community is actually pretty nice. Yes, there are people we have problems with, and yes, we have discontinued conversations and communication with many folk over the years. But that's the cool thing about the gaming community. If it, you can just like disconnect and you don't have to worry about it. Like seeing other people in real life, you, you can't. It's a little trickier. <laughs> just, just a little trickier. So, um, yeah. Here we are. It is rinsed out after sitting for 48 hours batching. Um, rinsed out in cold water to remove the soda ash and then rinsed in warmish hottish water to remove a lot of the excess dye. I don't get a lot of excess dye when I do black, I've noticed. Um, the reds, uh, you, get, you get color forever. But the black, you really don't. And this turned out really cool. I mean, honestly, it kind of reminds me of Stormy Nights. You know, like that, that lightning flashing behind really dark clouds or it just might be me. I don't know. Either way, it looks cool. So I'm hoping she likes it. I'm sure she will let me know if she doesn't. And if she doesn't, that's perfectly fine too. You know, everybody's allowed to have their own opinions, but I'm sure she'll like it. That's what she wanted. That's what she asked for. So this is going to be washed in the regular wash. No special laundry detergent or anything like that. And here it is in the sunshine. Black is nice and dark. It's not gray. My white is popping through nice and clear. Not a whole lot of le bleeding or anything, and it's pretty crisp. So I like it. And I hope you guys do too, and I hope she does too when she gets it. In the meantime, if you like what you see, feel free to like, share, subscribe, follow, hit that bell for notifications on future videos if you want, or don't up to you. I don't care. If you want to just come and hang out, I'm fine with that too. But either way, I thank you for your support and I hope to see you again and we'll see you later. Bye!